Hey guys, this is Aarti Shubha. Hope you're all doing good. Welcome to the Story Insights. Discover the undiscovered you. Please do subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon. Today's story is Live and Work. In today's chaotic world, having family time isn't always easy. It can get pretty hard to coordinate schedules, especially if the family is large. Life demands that we work, add in school, nurture friendships, hobbies, etc. All of those things are extremely time-consuming and important. But so is spending time with your family. Let's get into the story. A father was a hard-working man who delivered bread as a living to support his wife and three children. He spent all his evenings after work attending classes, hoping to improve himself so that he could one day find a better-paying job. Except for Sundays, father hardly ate a meal together with his family. He worked and studied very hard because he wanted to provide his family with the best money he could buy. Whenever the family complained that he was not spending enough time with them, he reasoned that he was doing all this for them. But he often yearned to spend more time with his family. The day came when the examination results were announced. To his joy, father passed and with distinctions too. Soon after, he was offered a good job as senior supervisor, which paid him handsomely. Like a dream come true, father could now afford to provide his family with life's little luxuries like nice clothing, fine food and vacation abroad. However, the family still didn't get to see father for most of the week. He continued to work very hard, hoping to be promoted to the position of a manager. In fact, to make himself a worthy candidate for the promotion, he enrolled for another course in the Open University. Again, whenever the family complained that he was not spending enough time with them, he reasoned that he was doing all this for them. But he often yearned to spend more time with his family. Father's hard work paid off and he was promoted. Jubilantly, he decided to hire a maid to relieve his wife from her domestic tasks. He also felt that their three-room flat was no longer big enough. It would be nice for his family to be able to enjoy all the facilities and comforts of a condominium. Having experienced the rewards of his hard work many times before, father resolved to further his studies and continue working at being promoted again. The family still didn't get enough time to see him. In fact, sometimes father had to work on Sundays entertaining clients. Again, whenever the family complained that he was not spending enough time with them, he reasoned that he was doing all this for them. But he often yearned to spend more time with his family. As expected, father's hard work paid off and he bought a beautiful condominium overlooking the coast of Singapore. On the first Sunday evening at their new home, father declared that he decided not to take any more courses or pursue any more promotions. From then on, he was going to devote all his time to with his family. Father didn't wake up the next day. We often think that it's all about quantity when it comes to the time we spend with our family, whereas it's the quality time that we need to give our family and children. You give money and things to your family, but what does your family need the most? Your time. For your family, your time spent with them is life precious jewels that embedded in their memories forever. Hope you like this story. Let's meet in another interesting story. Bye-bye.